is the Big O Show. This is the Big O Show. Uh, David Triana says, in each of London's first three seasons with Houston, he was there for four. The Texans ranked third in the AFC and sixth in the NFL in rushing per game. Yep, and so the and, and you're talking about uh, Charles London, and that is the interesting part. Mike McDaniel, he he, I, I the, you know the guy that's going to fall in love with Mike McDaniel the most. And he doesn't know this yet. It's Omar. Right. Omar Kelly, like, I love Omar Kelly, bro. He, he's so awesome. He's a great dude. But, yes, he does contradict himself at times, okay? And I, and I do a good job of pointing it out in the, in the middle of interviews at times. But he's the guy that loves running. He loves running backs, and he loves offensive line play, and he knows the importance of having a running game, and so does Mike McDaniel. And that's why his, you see his first moves. That dude cares about building the line. And, you know, Flo failed in finding the offensive line coach. Mike McDaniel cannot afford to do that. There, that that's, the, that's the twisted part about all of this. The room for error for Mike McDaniel is very thin. And he's got to figure out quickly. And the good thing is, that's his passion. The offense, the running game, the quarterback, all of that. And that's where Miami has its weakness. So if he's able to get a quarterback on defense like a Vic Fangio, and then he's able to fix the issues on offense, and especially in the running game, that is going to open everything up for everyone. And if Tua's, Tua's facing linebackers on their heels, that's, that's the good life. If he's facing linebackers that are all on their toes, well, that's the bad life. And that's where it changes.